Welcome by Smiling Spirit Yoga. Nice of you to join today. And we're gonna start with the mantra Om Namo Guru Dev Namo. Sit in the easy pose. Place your left hand onto your right one. Make little balls of your hands. Take a deep breath and we'll start. Om Namo Guru Te Namo Om Take a deep breath and exhale. And then place your hands onto your knees. When you inhale, you bend forward and then you rotate clockwise. Exhale on the back. So inhale on the front, rotate clockwise and exhale on the back. And just move around the way you like it in your breathing time. Make sure that you move around on your tailbone, there where your first chakra is rooted. Grounding yourself, getting out of your head into your body and wakening up your body. Wakening up the energy that is rooted in your first chakra. It's a red energy, a primal energy. Keep moving around, loosening up your spine, your shoulders, your lower back, your hips. Wake up. And then we'll reverse. So go anti clockwise. Inhale on the front and exhale on the back. Loosening up the shoulders. And really move around onto your tailbone. Nail on the front and exhale on the back. Let's do two more. And then the last one. And then slowly come back in the middle. And then you walk your hands forward. You bend forward as far as you can. Let your head relax. Let your shoulders relax, let your arms relax, and first breathe towards your chest and your shoulders, letting go of any tension that is still in your shoulders or your chest. And then you breathe towards your belly and your lower back, using your breath to get deeper into the posture. And when you inhale towards your belly, press your belly out, and then exhale, pull your belly in. Bend forward, sinking down, letting go. And then you inhale, you lift up your head and you walk both hands towards the left. Bring your right hand onto your left one and then bend all the way towards the side. Let your head relax in between your arms. Keep breathing towards your chest and your shoulders first, and then towards your belly if you can. When you breathe towards your belly, press the belly out and pull them in. 
sinking down, stretching the right side of your body. And then inhale, lift up your head again, walk both hands back into the middle and then all the way towards the right. Place your left hand onto your right one. And your head comes in between your arms all the way down. Maybe your front of your head is leaning onto your knee. Maybe not. It's all okay. Deep breathing, sinking down, using your breath. Letting go of any tension or tightness in your body. And then you inhale, lift up your head again, come back into the middle and then one more time go down in the middle and then feel if there is any difference at the first time. Did you create some more space? Is it easier to go down? Have you been using your breath to let go of any tightness? Let your neck relax, your shoulders. And then you inhale, slowly come all the way back up and we're going to do the table pose. So place your feet onto the mat. Your feet are about hip width distance apart and pretty close towards your bottom. You bring your hands behind you with the fingertips pointing towards your bottom. On an inhale, you lift up your hips as high as you can and you drop your head back. So you inhale, tense your bottom, lift up your hips, press your feet in the mat and drop your head back. Inhale, lifting up. And if you don't like it when your head is back, you can also keep looking forward. Keep doing this exercise in your own breathing time. So inhale, lifting up, tense your bottom, press the inner thighs towards each other, press your feet in the mat and drop your head back if you like that. Keep going in your own breathing time. And then the last one, and this last one, you hold it. So keep tensing your bottom, keep breathing. You're holding the table pose, pressing your feet in the mat, pressing the inner thighs towards each other. Maybe you have your head back. You don't need to do that. Try to breathe towards your chest. Very good. Holding the table pose. One more. When you inhale and when you exhale, first bring your head back and then bring your hips back. Stretch your legs to the front, place your right foot on the mat, and then with your left arm, you go around your right knee, bringing your right fingertips behind you. Take a deep breath, lifting up, and we're twisting here, looking back, breathing with your chest, pulling your belly in, pull the knee towards your chest so that you feel the whole spine twisting. The lower back, the middle back, in between your shoulder blades. And then you inhale, slowly come back. Hold your right knee, pull your left toes towards you, lifting up your left leg, tiny movement up and down, pull your belly in, keep breathing, tiny movement up and down, tightening the muscles, two more, last one, and then we're going to bend forward, so place your right foot against your left leg, inhale, and when you exhale, bend forward, bring your nose towards your knee, and try to relax both legs. Use your breath again to get deeper into the posture. Keep breathing, sinking down over your left leg. And then you inhale, slowly come back up. We're going to do the other side, placing your left foot on the mat, wrapping your right arm around your left knee, bring the left fingertips behind you, take a deep breath, stretching up, 
and then exhale, turn and twist. So you're pulling your belly in, you're breathing with your chest, and you're pulling your knee towards you so that you feel your whole spine twisting. Looking back as far as you can, relax your shoulders. Breathing with your chest. And then you inhale. Slowly come back, and then you keep holding the left knee with both hands. You pull your right toes towards you, tense your belly muscles, lift up your right leg, tiny movement up and down. Tightening those core muscles. Well done. And then you place your left foot against your right leg. You inhale, and when you exhale, bend forward over your leg. Keep breathing towards your chest. Pull your belly in. Let your head relax. Let your shoulders relax. Let your neck relax. Very good. Keep breathing, sinking down, relaxing over your right leg. And then on an inhale, you slowly come all the way back up. And then you cross your legs. And you come into your hands and knees. And we'll start a cat cow. Your hands are underneath your shoulders, your arms are stretched. On an inhale, you look up, you pull your shoulders back, you curl your back. And when you exhale, you arch, you pull your belly in, you bring your chin towards your chest, and you press your hands away from you. So inhale, curl, looking up. Exhale, arch, pull your belly in. Inhale, curl. And exhale, arch. Inhale, curl. And exhale, arch. Inhale, curl. And then we're holding this leg, the last one, keep arching your back and then slowly with an arch back you bring your bottom towards your feet when your bottom is touching your feet you stretch your arms forward as far as you can and then you bring the front of your head onto the mat we're coming into a child's pose breathing towards your chest and your shoulders sinking down your shoulders towards the mat relaxing your neck and then if you can start breathing towards your belly so that you can also relax your lower back And then you inhale, slowly come back up and we're going into a downward facing dog. So place your toes in the mat, you lift up your hips, you pull your belly in and you let your head relax, press your hands away from you. Walk the legs, so stretch them a little bit up. Maybe move your head towards the left and the right so that your neck is completely relaxed. And then you look at your hands and you place your hands a little bit more forward. Then when you inhale, you sink your right knee down and you come forward, you look forward, pull the belly in. Exhale, back into a downward facing dog, left side. Inhale, left knee down, looking forward, pull your belly in and exhale, back up. Do that again. Inhale, right knee down, looking up, sort of high plank with your knee down. And exhale, back. Inhale, left side, looking up. And exhale down. When you inhale, lift up your right leg, pull your knee in and step forward. And then lower your left knee down. Sink into your hips, move a little bit around, creating some space. Then come up and place both hands onto your upper leg, your right upper leg. On an inhale, you press your right foot in the mat and you lift more up. And when you exhale, you sink down into your hip. So inhale, lifting up. Exhale, sinking down. 
Create space. Inhale, lifting up. And exhale down. Inhale, lifting up. And exhale, sinking down. Inhale, lifting up. And sinking down. Then your right arm goes onto your right upper leg. Place your thumb and index finger together. Your left hand is onto your left leg. You inhale, you lift up, and then turn and twist, look back, sinking down into your hip, relaxing the shoulders, twisting here, breathing with your chest. And then on an inhale, you come back. Placing both hands onto the mat, then lean onto your left, place your left toes in the mat and stretch your left leg. You inhale, you come up, and then you bring your right arm up. Looking up towards the ceiling and your hands. Very good. Slowly come back down, stepping back into a downward facing dog, and we'll do the other side. So lifting up the left leg, bend your knee, step forward, and then let your right knee sink down. And then move your hips again a little, making some space, creating space by the hips. Sinking down, moving towards the left and the right. And then place your left foot in the mat, bring both hands onto your upper leg. Inhale, lifting up, press your foot in the mat, and exhale, sinking down into your hip. Same thing as we did before. So inhale, push yourself up, push the hands onto the leg, and exhale, sinking down into your hip. Inhale, lifting up, and exhale, sinking down. Inhale, lift up, and exhale, sink down. Stay here. Then your right arm goes onto your right leg. Thumb and index finger are together. Bring your right hand on the back of your right leg. Twisting, looking back. Breathing with your chest. Sinking down into your hip. Holding. Sinking down. Breathing and twisting. And then you inhale, slowly come back, place both hands onto the mat, leave your right hand, bring your right toes in the mat, stretch your right leg, and then your left arm goes up, twisting, looking up towards the ceiling, and your hand. Nice big twist, opening up your shoulders, your chest, twisting your back. And come back down, stepping back into a downward facing dog. Then walk your hands towards your feet. Wrap your arms as tight as possible behind you by your legs. So maybe you're grabbing the elbows or your hands just as tight as you can. When you have it all tight, let your head relax, let your neck relax, let your shoulders relax. And try to press the knees back. Pull the belly in. Keep the eyes open so that you don't lose your balance. And if you can, maybe slide not a little bit more down towards the mat with your arms so that you're even tighter, glued onto your legs. Pull the belly in, lift up the hips, press the knees back, let your head and your neck relax. Keep breathing with your chest because you're pulling your belly in. And then you relax your legs. Oh, your, sorry, your arms <laughs> and your legs. You bend your knees and then slowly come all the way back up. And then come into the middle of the mat. Bring the feet together, bring the legs together, tense your bottom, pull your belly in. And we're going to make it really tight and strong. And especially tensing your bottom is really important. Press the inner thighs towards each other. Then you bring your arms up, interlace all of your fingers, but your index finger, crush your thumbs, and your arms are glued onto your ears. On an inhale, you lift up, and then you bend towards the side, exhaling back. Inhale, lifting up, bend towards the other side. And then exhaling, coming back. Keep your bottom tight. Go on, inhale, lift up. 
exhale bend towards the sides bring your hip towards the side as well when you're bent inhale lifting up lift up the chest elongate your spine and exhale back into the middle two more inhale and exhale coming back last one inhale lifting up and exhale slowly come back now we're gonna bend towards the back so you inhale lifting up tense your bottom bend back look back stretch as far back as you can Pull the belly in, slowly exhaling back. Now we're going to bend forward. Inhale, lifting up. Elongate, exhale, stretch, stretch forward as much as you can until you're touching the floor. And then you walk your hands towards you. You bend your knees. You inhale and you slowly come all the way back up. We're going to do this one again, but now you're going to be standing in front of your mat. Okay, right, tighten everything, your bottom, your belly, your legs, inhale, bring your arms alongside your ears, interlace your fingers, but your index finger, cross your thumbs, inhale, lifting up, exhale, bend towards the sides, inhale, lifting up, exhaling, slowly come back, inhale, lifting up, bend towards the sides, and exhale, pull yourself back. Inhale, lifting up. Exhale, towards the side. One more time. And back. The other side, one more time. Lifting up. And exhale, back. Now we're going to bend towards the back. You inhale, you lift up. And then you tense your bottom, bend back, drop your head back, look back as much as you can, reach back and slowly come back. Inhale, lifting up and then we're bending forward as far as you can and exhale when you're touching the mat. Place your hands on the mat or your fingertips. Bend through your knees and then step back with your right foot and your right leg. A big step. Come up into a warrior two. Bending the front knee, looking over your hand forward. Relax the shoulders. Keep breathing with your chest. Maybe bend up a little bit more. Good. Now go into a reverse warrior. Inhale, lifting up your left arm, looking up, your right hand is onto your right leg on the back. Holding here, stretching the side of your body. Keep breathing. And slowly come back into a warrior two. And now we're going to go into a half moon pose. Bring cartwheel your hands down, bring both hands down. And your right foot comes a little bit more in. So that you can lift your right leg all the way up. You place your left fingertips in front of you on the sides. And then bring your right arm up. You can look down towards the floor. But you can also try and look up towards your right hand and the ceiling. Standing strong. Pull your belly in. Flex your foot. Stretch both legs if possible. Keep breathing. That's the most important part. And then slowly bring your right hand down, step your right foot next to your left one. You inhale, look up, exhale, relax, and then step back with your left. Do the other side. Warrior two, bending through the front knee, looking over your front hand. Breathing with your chest, relaxing the shoulders. And then we'll go into a reverse warrior. Bring your arm up, looking up towards the ceiling. Nice side stretch. Keep breathing with your chest. Sinking down into your front knee. Back leg is stretched. And then slowly come back into a warrior two again. 
Okay, half moon pose. Cartwheel your arms down. Step a little bit forward with your back leg. Then lift up your back leg. Bring the right fingertips in front of you. And then the left arm goes up in a half moon pose. And just see what is good for you, how you can balance. Maybe you're looking down, maybe you're looking towards the side, maybe you can look up towards the ceiling, pull your belly in, flex your foot, try to stretch both legs. Keep breathing, that's the most important part. Don't think about anything else but your balance exercise. Stay focused, concentrate. Key to a balance exercise, concentration. Then your left arm goes down, your left foot comes to next to your right one. You inhale, look up, and then exhale, we're going down into a crow pose. Bring your feet further apart from each other on each side of the mat. Bring your hands into a praying pose if you can, and we're going to do the breath of fire. You can do it through your nose or through your mouth, it goes like this. And you're pulling your belly in every time when you're exhaling. Or through your mouth like this. Feel what feels good for you. And if you find it too difficult, a breath of fire, maybe I'll explain it to you later in another video. Just easy breathing. Using your breath to getting deeper into the posture by your hips and your lower back. Then take a deep breath and then exhale, sink your bottom down towards the mat and we'll lie down and relax for a minute. Take another deep breath towards your belly and exhale, sink down, relax. Let your face relax, let your shoulders relax, your arms become heavy and relaxing your hands and your fingers. Relax your hips, your lower back. Let your legs become heavy. Relax your feet and your toes. And then focus on your breathing. Try to let your breath go as natural as possible. And it is difficult when you're focusing on it. But your body doesn't need you to breathe. It can do it all by itself. So try to be the observer of your breath. Let your body do the breathing. Focus and concentrate. Watch your breathing. Let your body take over. Breathe natural. Your body is happy. It's sinking down. You're relaxing. You're focusing and watching your breath go natural. Be the observer. And then take a deep breath again. And exhale. And then bring your right knee towards you. Grab it with both hands. Relax your shoulders. Your chin is a little bit towards your chest, like you have a three double under chin. If you don't feel the stretch in your right hip when you're pulling on it, press with the knee against your hands. Make it an active pose. Pull your belly a little bit in so that your spine is still flattening on the mat. You're breathing with your chest, you're relaxing your shoulders, your chin is a little bit towards your chest. Stretching your hip. 
then lift up your left leg and make this tiny movement up and down. Pull your toes towards you, pull your belly in. Tiny movement up and down, tightening those core muscles again. Breathing with your chest, tiny movement up and down. And relax your leg. Then hold your knee with your left hand. Pull your knee all the way towards the left side. Turn your head towards the right and we're twisting here. Let your arms relax. Let your legs become heavy and sink down into the mat and use your breath to get deeper into the posture. So you're breathing towards your belly so that you can relax the back and the hips and your bottom. Breathing towards your chest so that you can relax your shoulders, your arms, your neck and also relax your face. Let your body sink down into the mat. And then first turn your head back into the middle. Then bring your legs back into the middle. Take a deep breath. Exhale. And then we'll do the other side. Bring your left knee towards you. Grab your knee with both hands. Pull your knee towards you so that you feel the stretch in your left hip. And if you don't feel it, press with your knee against your hands. Let your shoulders relax. Bring your chin a little bit towards your chest. Keep holding your knee and then you lift up your right leg, pull your toes towards you, tense your belly muscles, tiny movement up and down again. Keep pulling the belly in, breathing with your chest, keep holding your knee, flex your foot, tiny movement up and down. Very good. Now relax the right leg. Hold your left knee with your right hand. Pull the knee all the way towards the right. Turn your head towards the left. Nice twisting and using your breath to get deeper into the posture. Let your body relax and sink down into the mat. And then turn your head back into the middle. Bring your legs back onto the mat. Take another deep breath. And exhale. And let's do that again. Take another deep breath. And exhale. 
And then bring both of your knees towards your chest and rock a little bit from side to side, relaxing your back, maybe relaxing your shoulders by lifting up your head. Just move around the way you like it, massaging your back. And then you're going to use your legs to pull yourself up and sit in the easy pose. And then we're going to start with a meditation and a breathing. We're doing uh, it in, in one. So we're meditating and breathing at the same time. Your spine is straight. Your legs are relaxed. Your shoulders are relaxed. Your hands are open on your knees and you bring your thumb and index finger together. Your chin is a little bit towards your chest. And then take a deep breath. And when you exhale, you feel your body sinking down into the mat. Feel those sitting bones touching the mat, rounding yourself there. Take another deep breath and let your body relax, sink down into the mat. And then start breathing just through the nose. So you're inhaling through your nose and you're exhaling through your nose. Easy breathing, relaxed breathing. When you inhale, you're counting till four. And when you're exhaling, you're counting till four as well. Try to make your in and exhaling just as long. Counting till four when you inhale and counting to four when you're exhaling. Focus all of your attention on your breathing and your counting. Your body is relaxed, you don't have to think about that anymore. Your spine is straight, your legs are relaxed, your shoulders are relaxed. Easy breathing through your nose, counting your breath. Focusing on your counting and your breathing. Let all else go. And then you take a very deep breath, hold your breath, and then exhale, open your eyes again, 
Namaste. Thank you for joining. If you want to go for the Savasana, just lie down. Let your body become heavy. Sink down into the mat. Take another deep breath. And exhale. Let's do that two more times. Take a very deep breath towards your back. And when you exhale, you let your body sink down into the mat. Last one. Deep breath. And exhale, sinking down. Relax your face. Relax your shoulders, your arms, your hands and your fingers. Relax your back, your lower back and your hips. And let your legs become heavy and sink down into the mat. Relax your feet and your toes. And then focus on your breathing. Just breathe through your nose. Easy breathing in and out. We're going to do the same meditation as we just did. So you're inhaling, counting to four. Exhaling, counting to four. Easy breathing, focusing on your counting and your breathing. Let your body relax and sink down into the mat. Focus on your breathing and your counting. Let everything else go. Just relax, sinking down, breathing, counting, relaxing. 